to travel about six months ago. I thought things at home were bad then, but what did I know? I wanted to find who I was and leave everything behind, free from society that was plaguing my mind. I wanted to see beautiful things and to see them alone, but I'm reflecting and regretting the company of my phone. See, I saw nature at its finest, things people only wish they could see, but then I would validate that experience with a selfie of me. See, I think I filled the emptiness with an Insta account, obsessing with how many followers I can amount, how many likes, how many shares, how many strangers can I impress. I just checked for Mowen, but I must look my best. I really hope your life is as wonderful as your profile appears. But why do we never upload pictures of heartbreak and tears? You see that picture of me on the beach smiling, my heart was breaking. And I'm broken, and I'm broken, and I'm broken, but a stranger just liked my post, and that's a plaster for my crumbled heart, so I'll keep hashtagging, hash bragging, hash gagging. This is not food for the soul, but benign distractions trying to fill a hole that cannot be sold by staring at a stream. What sharing is not caring, it just perpetuates the dream that happiness is found in approval, and that is a toxic idea that keeps us all slaves to the missing out fear so we keep scrolling and swiping and our compulsive action never alone but alone devoid of all human reaction i want to take a filter and place it over earth's imperfections and photoshop out the global warming infection and and terrorism though that is not the biggest problem we face but the media mongers fear and turns race against race and suddenly refugees are now immigrants and the Muslims are ISIS and they're now all drowning in a population crisis and I lean so left and the leaders stand right so my conscience is tortured when I lay down at night so we all must unite now more than ever but the people chose Brexit and to not stay together and when politics is bleak we lose faith in our votes and we find ourselves comfort in an Instagram quote and it all seems so hopeless this state of reality so no wonder we hide in a synthetic vanity i want to switch it all off i want to leave it and go p.s please make sure you like my video